Hello everyone, and welcome to our next video of Backstage Pass, John's Route, and I've gone a few videos <laughs> without looking at my inventory, and I completely forgot that we had all of these little things that we could use. Well, it's all just in this little screen right here, but, you know. Um, so, <laughs> I guess we'll use some of these. I'm not sure what all they bring up, so I'm just gonna use all of them, I guess, and just figure out... Yeah, there's a charisma one. There was an intelligence one. Uh, walk that way. <laughs> but yeah, so I guess we got some charisma up and some intelligence up because of that, <laughs> and got rid of fatigue that was not there. <laughs> <laughs> so, we've got all that up. I know one of them, one of those uh, video games ended up helping your fitness, but I don't remember which one. <laughs> um, oh, look at all our stuff. I wish we're, we're just gonna do this. Oh, pff, really? No. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Going to outfits, see what outfits we have. Is there no... there's no... that's... that's like a bug. There's no arrow back. Huh. Okay. Anyways, so I guess... Uh, we could do whatever. <laughs> uh, we could go back... we can go to the mall, we can call friends, um, we could sleep. Uh, hmm, I guess we'll go shopping again. We're gonna go into the mall. I don't know if there's any other scenes that I'm missing. I could be, but I don't remember. Wait! Uh, just tell me what it is you want! Where are the bombs? That was a bomb. Whoa, I think my heart is still racing. I probably should have guessed it would be all action from the title, though. On the bright side, I feel more familiar with other people in the industry now. Yes. Okay, so I guess we'll... We don't have to worry about fitness or fashion anymore. So either we can just get a lot of money, or we could blog a lot, or we could study a few times. Uh, I think we're gonna work and then study and then go into town. We'll do that. Why not? Oh no. No. <laughs> no. I have to keep on forgetting the Monday. Hey girly! Asks. Interested in our lottery today? Uh, no thank you. I'm, I'm not usually interested anyways. I always lose. <laughs> so... <laughs> hey look, my intelligence is all the way up. <laughs> so really, the only stat I need to worry about is charisma and... Eh. I don't even Miss care. Goody, I'm pleased to inf- Thanks. I wish you the best. Thanks, I'll do my best. Awesome. I'm just gonna study and it's gonna bring my GP up a little bit. Not that much, but it works. And going into town to get some faux. Faux. I examined the box that, one, that once housed the cupcakes I won at the school festival last... <laughs> yes, the school festival is a fair whatever. It's, it, it's basically the same thing. <laughs> last week. <laughs> There's a club on campus somewhere called Sugar and Spice, and they make cupcakes. The print on the box says they meet in one of the buildings on campus. Oh, I know where that is. This place is pretty hidden from the rest of campus. No wonder I've never seen it before. Hey, are you new here? Yeah, I was wondering if there were... If this was... If this is where... Oh my goodness, let me restart that. Yeah, I was wondering if this is where the baking club meets. Sure is. I'm the club pres. Nice to meet you. Did you come here to bake? If it's okay. Totally. We're open to non-members on the weekend. Do you know your way around this kitchen? What should I say? Uh, I'll ask for help just because this is like the first time you guys see the cooking, I guess. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you showed me ar around. No problem. So, over here we've got all our ingredients. Pick a batter, a frosting, and a garnish for the cupcake you want. If you come up with an especially good combination, you can save the recipe and use it again later. 
My favorite recipe is angel food cake with whipped cream and strawberries. You should try it sometime. Sounds good. See you around. But now we can bake cupcakes. Oh my goodness. We can bake cupcakes. Cupcakes are like the best thing. I like, I, I tend to like, um, just mess up all the time. Unless I have like a, the actual recipes that is like in front of me, I tend to mess up. <laughs> and it always gives me like a, ew, this is not a good cupcake. What are you trying to feed me? So, you know, it's great. <laughs> I think this time around we'll just call Hello? John. Uh, maybe next time we can call Lloyd, just because. Hi, John. I was wondering if you wanted to go somewhere. I suppose today. it couldn't hurt. Whereabouts did you have in mind? Hmm, movie theater or cafe diem? Well, he loves acting, so maybe the movie theater. But I don't remember what movies he liked. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go to cafe diem because I am a dork. <laughs> okay. We're gonna just wear that. Greetings, my lady. Greetings. Have you picked something to I eat thought yet? I might leave that part to you. Oh, I forgot to change my outfit. Oh well, that works. Um, well, <laughs> I wonder I if we can go back. Nope, we can't I scroll back I might to the outfit. Uh, so I guess spinach and pear. And you remain ever responsible. Why? Yes, I do. That's as good a reason as any. Always a pleasure. <laughs> Thanks, John. <laughs> oh, wait. I think there's like uh, extra scenes that I haven't seen yet. Or maybe I have. I I don't remember, but like, we'll see. <laughs> okay, so, um, now, what do I want to do? Let's blog and work and study and go to town. Just for the fun of it. <laughs> Yep. Going through the week. Going through the week. <laughs> We're enjoying the week. We're having a good week. Good job, Sean. Okay, so status, we're all good status-wise. Vice versus. Okay, we're gonna read this. Hey, check it out, guys. If you need a vice versus fix, Selena Horaway is going to be in a movie called Night Witches. It looks really good. I'm glad to see her career is back on track. I really missed seeing her. Okay, and then... Why did I click on that? Who knows. Um, and I think that's all. I think we'll just go out with Lloyd, cause why not? Greetings! Hello, would you like to go somewhere this weekend? Ouch! Wish I could, but duty calls. Next time? Right. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> I should guess I should have expected that. <laughs> okay, well, I just know that Lloyd is a pretty awesome dude, so... I don't know if there's anything special that happens if you are romancing John, and you're also friends with Lloyd? I, I honestly don't know. So, I, I don't know. Uh, we could go shopping again. Go see that last movie. <laughs> Funny thing about love. You can't be in love with me! What? Why? Because I'm in love with you! Well, we can't both be in love with each other. <laughs> That's what I'm saying! <laughs> that was an amusing movie. Nothing's gro nothing groundbreaking, but it was a nice diversion. On the bright side, I feel more familiar with other people in the industry now. That's that's good. Good job. That's kind of funny, actually. So, uh, we'll just do the same thing again, I guess. Hi. <laughs> and continuing on. <laughs> and 
Yes! Speed through this. Okay. Um, foe. That's right. Because that's just your weekly routine, Sean. <laughs> hey, Sean, just wanted to remind you my launch event is next week. Yeah, Tuesday morning at the bookstore, right? You got it. I'll be there. Cool. Alrighty. So, nothing. This is, I think this is like around the time where you're expected to go on dates because you can make cupcakes. And so it's like the, the point in time where you're expected to go on dates instead of going on dates at the very beginning. But I end up doing that anyways. <laughs> So, it's fairly barren at this point in time. So, we're just gonna, I guess... Hmm. Hmm. We could try going shopping again, but... Eh, we'll, we'll go to GameGo, see if they have any... I know there's, like... I know on, a, on one of the other routes, there's like a short little scene at Game Go, but I don't, <laughs> I don't know if that's, that's like in any of the other routes or not. So we're just gonna do the same routine again and see if anything happens. <laughs> do, 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 do. Adam CD launches today. I should head to the bookstore to meet up with him. Hey, how do I look? I'm nervous. You've got that awkward smile you put on right before a big test. That obvious, huh? <laughs> to someone who knows you, yes. What's wrong? This is the first time I'm going to have to talk to fans, like, face to face. It's different when I'm on stage singing. What if I say something stupid to someone? Um... Yeah, yeah, I know. Saying stupid things is inevitable. Actually, I was going to say I'm impressed with how seriously you're taking this. A year ago, you wouldn't have cared this much. Don't get too excited. It's my one adult-like deed for the year. <laughs> well, do your best. Here come your fans. The doors to the bookstore open and a flood of excited fans enters. The bookstore staff do their best to direct people into a single line, but I can hardly... I can barely hear them over the sound of the excited crowd. I see John standing a distance away, watching Adam carefully. We make eye contact and he motion motions for me to move aside. I quickly join John as the fans line up in front of Adam's table. Here for moral support? Adam said he'd feel better if I were here. Are you sure you can handle the crowds? It's easier when I'm not the center of attention. I see. Adam appears to be doing pretty well. He's chatting and laughing comfortably, comfortably with each of the fans as they approach. From the back of the room, I hear a high-pitched scream and a coconut sails through the air, smacking Adam in the face. Your music is garbage and you suck! John immediately flags down a couple burly men standing nearby. The security guards waste no time in removing the girl from the bookstore, but the damage has already been done. I notice a few people have their phones out. They probably managed to record the whole thing. If Adam says something stupid now, this is going to wind up all over the internet. What should I do? Let Adam handle it on his own, or try to help Adam out of the situation. I'll let him handle it on his own. I watch as Adam rubs his face ruefully. There's a slight pink mark where the coconut hit him, but he seems to be doing okay. He turns to the crowd and flashes a huge grin. <laughs> Glad that wasn't a pineapple. A ripple of laughter courses through the crowd and the tension in the store dissolves. Adam returns to signing CDs and the event finishes without any further incident. As soon as I step into the makeup trailer and the door slams shut behind me and I hear the soft click of the lock turning. I spin around. Oh, okay, so the music kind of... it, it just kept on going. What? <laughs> I know what the scene is. I know what it is because it's in basically as long as you keep on going to work, it, it's in like every route. But like, 
<laughs> oh my heck. <laughs> the, the Hawaiian music is not... It does not fit this scene at all. <laughs> Anyways. Good. Now we're alone. Allison? Um, hi. How are you? Don't act like you care, you backstabber! I don't know what you're talking about. Playing innocent? Nice try, but it won't work. I seriously don't know what you mean. I think right now I'm just going to just mute <laughs> the music <laughs> because honestly, this point in time, that music is not going to help you. <laughs> I walk through the door, but Allison places herself in my way. What are you doing? Saving John, of course. From what? You. You ruined him! I saw it on TV. John said it's all your fault he's like this! Saw on TV? Does she mean the interview? I take a deep breath. I think there's been a misunderstanding. About what? I didn't... I stop and stare at Allison. I've never seen her like this before, and I'm not sure what to do. What's going on? Didn't what? Can you explain what's wrong? John is! It's all wrong! He's not... He's not supposed to be like this! I wait patiently for Allison to continue. He's a great person, but now he's hurting people! You have to fix him! Sean! What's going on in there? Uh, um, Allison's in here. I hear the sound of a key turning in the lock. Then Rachel bursts into the trailer. Get away from her! No! You don't understand! She's going to ruin John! Rachel looks at me quizzically. I don't know. What's going on in here? As soon as she sees Selena, Allison relaxes. Katerina! Katerina? Selena looks confused at the mention of her character's name, but she quickly regains her composure. Hello. Can you tell me your name? Allison. And can you tell me what's wrong, Allison? John's all wrong. You know that. You're trying to stop him. Selena nods. I see. You're worried about John, then? Yes. That's a really scary feeling, isn't it? I understand. You do? Of course I do. I can talk to John about it, but I'd like you to do something, too. Yes? Can you call your parents? I think they can help me. Call my parents? That's right. Allison takes a moment to process what Selena is asking for, but she nods. I can do that. Sean, I think you should go home for now. I'll handle things from here. Oh, um, right. I quickly duck out of the makeup trailer before anything else can happen. Alrighty. And bringing back the... I, I forget how much it was. I think... Right there. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll just have it be right there. <laughs> But that was really weird, like the Hawaiian music just kept on playing and that does not fit that scene at all. <laughs> so <laughs> we're just gonna continue on, you know. Um, oh yeah, foe. So, because it's the end of the week. Do, do, do. Status, nothing, nothing. Um, I could use that, but I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, uh, uh. I could try to call Lloyd again, but I doubt that would help. Could call Benny Boy, could call Adam. Like, uh, uh, yeah, it wouldn't really help. Oh, hey, I didn't realize I actually had some affection with Matthew. <laughs> I didn't realize that. Well,. I guess, I guess we've got some affection with Matthew, too. Um, we'll, we'll just call John, I guess. Hello? I suppose. Eh. Cafe DM again. And we're going to actually change our clothes here. Unless I can't wear it anymore, but I doubt that's the case. Greetings, my lady. That's a lovely outfit you've chosen. Thank you, I do my I best. I'd do a spinach and feta again. And you remain ever responsible. Yeah, okay. Next time we'll do the scones just That's as good place. a reason as any. 
Always a pleasure. Um, there's nothing he says, but okay, that works. Um, I'm gonna blog, work, and study again. <laughs> Do, 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 do. I've been getting a few hits on my blog lately. It's not a lot, but I feel a little more popular. I'm gonna keep on going. See what was going on. I'm sure Selena's going to say something about it. Miss Haraway, are how are you? I'm fine, Sean. No need to worry about me. I'm sorry, it's just that after Allison. Yes. I do feel bad I couldn't do more for her. What happened? Her parents have been very private about the matter, but my best guess is that she had a psychotic break. What? Is she okay? I hope so. But again, her parents have been very private, as is their right. I'm impressed that you figured it out so quickly. I panicked more than I should have, and I think Rachel got overly defensive. I'm sure neither of you has had nearly as much experience as I do. Um, if it's not prying too much... I've had several stalkers in my time. One who was dearly convinced that I was in grave danger from an alien attack. He broke into my house and tried to take me away for my own protection. As a child, it was a very terrifying experience. I didn't fully understand what was going on. Afterwards, I resolved to learn as much as I could so that I'd be ready if it ever happened again. How old were you when this happened? Twelve. That's a really level-headed reaction from a twelve-year-old. You think so? I felt foolish for never considering it before. Well, now I feel like the foolish one for not seeing it sooner. You couldn't have known. And from what her parents said, I think this is her first break. Do you think she'll be okay? It's a complicated situation. Either way, I doubt we'll see her again for some time. Okay, well, <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see about that. I don't know. I think she ends up contacting you, I think. I could be wrong, but it, it's been a while since I've played this route. So this is actually kind of me remembering all of this. Um, ooh, anyone into fashion? Does that mean there's new stuff in? No, it just means that you want the dress, shawl, and sandals if uh, you're going after a certain someone. <laughs> so, you know, I, I won't read that one simply because why not? Um, oh, well, I could read it, but <laughs> I think I'm just going to end this episode right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I hope you have a great week, and we'll see you next time. Bye!